A boundary exists within our solar system known as the heliopause. This region of space acts like a boundary wall because the solar wind's heat is insufficient to counteract the influx of particles from distant stars, marking the transition between our solar system and interstellar space. Bert and Ernie from Sesame Street were given their names in homage to Bert the Cop and Ernie the Taxi Driver, characters featured in Frank Capra's classic film, It's a Wonderful Life. Kate Blanchett, the youthful Australian actress, risked losing her job in 2002 when she decided to shave off her blonde hair for her role as a fugitive in the film Heaven. This wasn't the first time the acclaimed actress had gone bald. During her rebellious teenage years at an all-girl grammar school, she experimented with punk and goth styles and even wore men's clothing. Australia is wider than the moon. The moon sits at 3,400 kilometers in diameter, while Australia's diameter from east to west is almost 4,000 kilometers. Rebel Wilson was originally set to become a lawyer, but she decided to take a gap year during her studies and went to Africa. There, she caught malaria and hallucinated that she was an actress. She liked that vision so much that she decided to change her career path, although she did graduate from law school. Did you know a cloud has an approximate weight of one million tons? An average rain cloud has a typical volume of about one cubic kilometer and a density of approximately 1.03 kilograms per cubic meter. This density is approximately 0.4% less than that of the surrounding air. Giraffes face a 30 times higher likelihood of being struck by lightning compared to humans. While there were only five confirmed cases of fatal lightning strikes on giraffes from 1996 to 2010, the species population was limited to 140,000 during that period. This results in an annual lightning-related death rate of about 0.003 per thousand giraffes, which is 30 times higher than the corresponding fatality rate for humans. The speed of Earth's rotation is undergoing a change. It is gradually slowing down. Consequently, the average length of a day increases by approximately 1.8 seconds per century. Going back 600 million years, a day was only 21 hours in duration.